The setting, Glen Cove, Long Island. The time, the late 1980s. The inciting incident, tonight is the opening night of Our Town, the Glen Cove High School play by Seminole American playwright Thornton Wilder. And now for the characters. This is Belinda Santiago, Philippine American goddess. This is my best friend, Tom Brzezinski. Hey, London, I found these in the gym. You going commando? Those aren't mine. Don't lie, London. Your mother sews your name right into them. He's right. My mother does sew my name into all my underwear. Checking out Belinda? No, shut up! You want to score with her? Simple. A chick's pussy is wired directly to her face. If you want Poontang, get her alone and stare her in the eye like this. That's how you unlock the padlocks to a clit. Tom's advice has always been questionable. Topaz, shut up! Remember, it's all about the connection. Second you let her out of your sight, she's prey for some other guy. So you never let her out of your sight. Topaz, shut the fuck up! Oh yeah, and that's Topaz, the neighbor's dog, and the agent of my undoing. The sky is beginning to show streaks of light over in the east there, behind our mountain. Here's Bob Williamson. He'll be completely bald in five years. Jacob Bianco, he pronounces paradigm paradigm. Michelle Zucker, she dresses like this in real life. And Belinda again. We already know how I feel about this girl. And there comes Joe Crowell Jr. delivering Mr. Webb Sentinel. I have one job to do. And there comes Joe Crowell Jr. Joe Crowell! Where are you, Joe? Deliver the paper. That was my first and last performance. But there's always the cast party. The cast party at Swenson's Ice Cream Parlor. The social event of the season. The air is fragrant with the smell of ice cream and hair gel. Tonight is electric. Anything can happen. This is Vinny Biancomano. He flexes his biceps at every party. Here's a fun fact about Tony Aiello. His parachute pants melted to his moped exhaust pipe. Had to have them surgically removed. Here's Sharon Cohen. She's secretly pregnant and will give birth on a roller coaster at Six Flags Great Adventure. The Mullen twins, always wrestling. Ricky Caterini aspires to have hair like Bon Jovi. This is Mr. Gould, our music teacher, AKA Spaghetti Head. Barb Ronzano. Yes, she is as stupid as she looks. Mike Apostopoulos has some incurable skin disease. Greg Peroni, a.k.a. Butterball. And here's me striking my sexy pose like Julia Roberts in Pretty Woman. Could it be? No, it's not true. It is. It's Belinda, and she's alone. Hi. Hi. Well, they always say to talk about what you know. Are you a fan of Blue House on the Prairie? No, but I do like those amazing animals. The one with the moonwalking macaw? I collect exotic chemicals. And you? Your aunt fed you a glass grape? Well, she didn't protest when I put it in my mouth. Did you know Mr. Von Drasic is gay? Is that why he hangs the boys in the coat hook by their underwear? What do you call your man part? Rose, after my grandmother. The night couldn't get much better. Would you like to drive me home? Until I'm overcome by the need to take a mean shit. Sure. We could stop at the high school parking lot. I should go to the bathroom, but I can't get Tom's advice out of my head. Hey, asswipe, never let her out of your sight. Check, please. I make one futile attempt to use the toilet. Um, hi, can you hurry up, please? Piss off, London. But it's just not gonna happen. But when I leave Swenson's hand in hand with Belinda, I'm a superstar, I'm Bon Jovi, Bruce Springsteen and Rob Halford all wrapped up in one. It almost makes me forget. I have to shit my brains out. The drive to the parking lot was the longest 15 minutes of my life. A cramp renders me paralyzed. Watch out! Are you okay? I should just tell Belinda the truth, but I really have to go to the bathroom. There's a kidney stone the 
size of a small diamond passing through my urethra. But I don't. Isn't that something 40-year-olds get? I had my first attack at seven. The pain is so great, my body is shaking uncontrollably. You're shaking uncontrollably. It's nothing, just having a mild seizure. What should I do? Should I hold your tongue? How about this? Suddenly, we're making out. I'm making out with Belinda Santiago. It's the agony and the ecstasy. This is happening. It's actually happening. And it's awesome. I'm touching her. Oh my god, what was that? Can't that wait? Nope. Nasty habit. Need one now. Why are you opening and closing the door like that? I have Tourette syndrome. Sometimes I do things involuntarily. I have literally seconds before I shit myself. Are we going somewhere? Yes, home. It's only nine o'clock. I have very strict parents. They choose for Jehovah. But we're not finished. Oh, yes, we are. You think I'm a dog? You have to believe me. I'm very attracted to you. Then why are you being so rude? I'm a gentleman. I don't like to rush things. Slow down, you fucking asshole. Get out. You're dead to me, London. Dead. Three houses before I'm home, I can no longer hold it in. You, Andy? Yes. Don't forget to turn off the light. Tonight, I committed social suicide. I might as well be dead. <laughs> you rotten motherfucker! Give me back my son's underwear! Now, this was the performance when Cove had been waiting for. about it is appealing everything the traffic will allow nowhere could you get that happy feeling when you are stealing that extra bow there's no people like show people they smile when they are low yesterday they told you you would not go far 